Hey, what is up, fellow critics? Yes, back at it again with another review reaction for you guys. Today, we're going to be doing Legion Season 3, Episode 7. Now, we're getting close to the end of the season. I'm really loving it. Uh, I think it's really cool. I think it's, once again, is going crazy with the episodes, and I'm enjoying it so much. So, before we start, please like, share, and subscribe to Cinema Critics. Now, let's go ahead and start it. I found someone. Professor. Like me. <laughs> I love that costume. Come to Morocco. <laughs> Shouldn't you be flying the plane? Are we getting a title? There it is. Oh, I love these. I love this area. Time between time. Yo, who's watching these badass kids? Yo, there's just a random door outside. Oh no, that's the front door. The front door is gone? They're insane, you know. I just let some random stranger in your house. Sorry. I made a mistake. I'm not supposed to be here. Oh, my beautiful boy, my David. Uh, oh man! Find out that's find out that's David. A vast other dimensional realm, unbound by anything but one's imagination. Yeah, I call it the astral plane. Yeah, Xavier was not that's up on that level. <laughs> no. Oh, time is so jacked up. Look at this. I kind of like him as um, Planet Xavier. They should probably add him to the, the new movies. Yo, this is crazy. You meet your Don't dad. I'm here to help. I'm here to help. Oh, time. He hears everything through. You know him. <laughs> oh, the cake. Cake is alive. The knowledge cake. Woo. Yo, is that safe though? Telling your dad everything that's got to happen? Time eaters. Oh, what the hell? Oh, t oh there they are. Wait, is the other Farouk gonna come? I think that's what's gonna happen. It's gonna be a showdown between both Farouks. And then David Charles, and Xavier. How was your sleep? Oh, look at him. <laughs> He's so intense. He keeps on throwing me all that hippie stuff. I'm David. Oh. You gotta get out of there. No. Oh no. Daddy. Oh, me. it's all the different ones, right? Yeah. Oh, the the crazy side. You think you have one crazy side? He has multiple crazy sides. Oh, it's my one. <laughs> that double chop. So like how you let a random now? person like just hang out now? Me. We're friends now. You just showed up at my house. Time, I heard something. David. Time eaters. We found David, but he's a baby, and we have to protect him because I don't know. <laughs> right? Baby. <sighs> Carry. Hey. Yeah, you're not gonna be able to stop them. Oh, they're going back from the when the house is being built. Oh, crazy. Oh, my God, look at that freaking face. Oh, damn. Wally mopped him. 
Oh, damn. There's a whole bunch of them now. What's going on? Oh, I see. So he has, like, people's minds locked up. And all these... People's minds locked up and all these kids. He's trying to get through. Oh, man. We're gonna have a tag team. Tag team. Let's go. Interesting. <laughs> and he's so much stronger. His older self is so much stronger than the younger self. Oh, no. One more. All right, so, yeah, that was the episode. Um... So it's really cool. Um, it's really about to go down next episode. So uh, David and uh, Switch, they're going all the way back until when David's a baby, and it's and it's affecting her so much. It's affecting time, and it brought back the time eaters. So anytime you see them during the episode, this time is just jumping constantly, and they did it throughout the whole episode. I thought it was really cool. So Sid and Carrie actually follow David through time and end up at his house when he was a baby, and Sid was chatting with his mom and letting him know, like, hey, you gotta make sure you love this kid. And then time, the time meter showed up, and uh, they had to somewhat deal with that. She kind of molly, Sid kind of molly a lot to one of the time meters with a freaking hammer, which is crazy. So they go back in time where actually Xavier... He actually meets up with Farouk for the first time, and uh, I think it was really cool. You can see a young Farouk, a crazy young Farouk, and all these freaking kids running around, the badass kids. But it comes out, David. So David shows up there and goes up to his dad. Is like, hey, you know, look at what happened. I'm your son. Look what happened. You, you know, you thought you killed him, but you didn't. He just went into my body, and I had to grow up with it. You know, so. David's really trying to uh, kill Farouk, and Xavier's trying to figure out what the hell's going on. But uh, future Farouk, who was stuck in time, the time between time, uh, made it out and actually showed up to meet up with the other Farouk. So uh, I think the next episode is going to be crazy. So we're going to have double Farouk versus freaking Xavier and David in a fight. Oh, man, that's going to be so intense. I can't wait. There. Plus, you got to worry about the time eaters going to be showing up. So you're going to have Sid, Carrie, and baby David worry about the time eaters with, you know, over there. So I think it's really, uh, really cool. I think it's setting up for a really good. I think last episode, uh, next episode is the last episode of the season, I believe. It looks like it. Um, guys, let me know. I, I think it is, though. But, yeah, it's really good, and I can't wait for the next episode, guys. So, let me know what you thought of the episode. Please leave your comments below, and please like, share, and subscribe to Cinema Critics. We'll catch you next video. Peace out.